past six weeks, Britain's Got Talent has scoured every corner of the UK for a talent fit to put before the Queen. We have always, always said, please think on a bigger scale. Please change your mind. And hoping they might be the people to do just that is our next act. Illusionists David and Karen. Ah, very good, thanks. Nice to meet you. Hi, nice, nice, to meet you. you. nice to meet you. I'm Karen, I'm 27. I'm David, I'm 39. And the name of the act is? David and Karen. I hope you'd say that. <laughs> We're going to be performing a magic act today. It's kind of like a physical grand illusion. And uh, we're going to do it like that. Thank you. We're going to be performing an illusion that was made famous by Houdini. But we have modernised it. People think magic can be quite boring because there's nothing new in the market at the moment. The old judging panel weren't too keen on magic and illusion. No, but, no. But with David, with David and Michael, they're, they're, they're willing to give it a go. Magic has uh, struggled on Britain's Got Talent in the past, but they haven't seen anything as dynamic and as entertaining as us. Time for magic to come back. <laughs> <laughs> you ready to do it? We're ready. Come on, come on. Come on. Straight on, guys. Good luck. Good luck. Have fun. Um, hi, hello. Welcome to Britain's Got Talent. What's your names, please? I'm David. And I'm Karen. What's the relationship between you two? We are magic partners. Oh. <laughs> and do you do magic for a living? Um, I'm a dance teacher. Excellent. Woo! And I'm a magician and illusionist, Michael. Full time? Yes. OK. We wish you the very best of luck. Magic partners, <laughs> the stage is yours. I really enjoyed that. That was really good. It was brilliant. It wasn't overly cheesy, because you need a little bit, you know. There's going to be a few of those mo moves of thrown in. <laughs> You've got to have the... That's part of that it, you know. You're putting, you're putting on a show. I never have any idea how anyone does the trick. I'm a complete sucker for it. It was incredible. And I loved it. Well done. You were very good. Amanda Holden. Yes, that was annoyingly good because I am never keen on magic because it's always so small time. People come on with cards and bits of cotton yeah. and no one can see anything. And you think this is a massive show and if it goes on to the Royal Variety, then that is a huge show to perform on. And there was no orange makeup, there was no lycra. I hate to say it, but it was really good. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We have been through so many magicians and they've been so boring and we always want, oh please, let's find one that comes in here, that takes the stage and wows us. And you did it right away. Congratulations. You are what this show is about. <laughs> terrific. It was awesome. Congratulations. Great. Okay, so we're going to vote on this. Uh, David, yes or no? Absolutely yes. Amanda? It's a yes from me. <laughs> Very well done. It's a yes from me too. Yes. Come on, come on, yeah. Come on. Right. 
fantastic. Well done. Oh, when I pulled that cloth off and I heard, I could hear the roar from the crowd. That was, that was the best moment of my life.